Race 37, our last three races of the week, and our last three races at Sedgefield. It's the Hunter Chasers. We've got a two mile six and a half handicap furlong here. So, uh, for Rainbow Italia, for Martin Needham, Inspirina, really for James Shea, Heathcote, Monarch for Thomas Rogers, Jadawi Stefano for James Shea, Mentalia for Alex Cherry, Swiss Gris for Stu Gray, and Romantic Liaison for Obi Wan makes up seven. As I said, we're into the last three races of the week. First, well, it's actually the second of the Hunter Chasers. They'll get over the first there. It's Heathcote Monarch that leads us from Mentalia. We had a Hunter Chaser on day two, which was won by myself. Yay! But anyway, back to this two mile six and a half furlong. Hunter Chase and it's Heathcote Monarch that's going to lead us into the second. A big ditch on, we've lost one. A big mistake there by Mentalia. Alex Cherry didn't get over it. Hasn't won a Hunter Chase this year, Alex Cherry, unusual. But he has moved up a few classes now. Doesn't uh, play with us little poor trainers down in the lower end of the league so much now. But anyway, it's Heathcote Monarch that leads by about four to Jadar with Stefano. Poor jump there by a romantic liaison. So we've only got six left in this. So go past the winning post. A couple of circuits to go. It's Heathcote Monarch for Thomas Rogers. Leads by about five from his from Jadawi Stefano. We've got Inspirina Relief with James Shea's horses and a length back to push the long Swiss Gris on the inside. Rainbow Italia and Romantic Liaison. They get to the fourth, the leader's over it. Oh, and we lost another one there. This time it's James Shea's Inspirina Relief. Drops his jockey. And we're down to five. We're still over two miles to go. It's still another 14 fences to take. So, uh, not for the faint hearted here. Heathcote Monarch leads him over the fifth, jumps it well, as does the rest this time. But Heathcote Monarch's got about a seven length advantage from Dijawa's Stefano in second, and though Italia's third, with Swiss Chris's fourth, and Romantic Liaison is fifth. As they'll go over the sixth, a little bit slow there was Rainbow Italia. But Heathcote Monarch stole the lead on this. Leads by five to Dijawa's Stefano. Still a big plain one. Oh, and this time is a mistake by Swiss Gris, went through the top of it. Shuffles back into last position. Not a plain one. Leaders over it. Oh, and this time again, Swiss Gris went through the top of it. Well, three's a charm. You imagine he may well go at the next. But it's Heathcote Monarch that leads us. Swing left handed. Line up for this big plain one again. Leaders over it. Oh, and there's a much better jump by Swiss Gris at the rear. So Heathcote Monarchs leads down to about three now to Jadal with Stefano. And a couple back to Romantic Liaison with Rainbow Italia and Swiss Gris. So with a mile and a half still to travel, it's Heathcote Monarch. By two to Jadal with Stefano, get to the big ditch. Leaders are over it, they all took that well. And jumped it fast. So it's Heathcote Monarch. By a length and a half to Jadal with Stefano. About four back to Romantic Liaison, Rainbow Italia and Swiss Gris all together. Still in this. There's plenty of racing still to be had. Coming to this big plain one, the leaders are over it. There's the remainder. Jumping well now. So Heathcote Monarch, being joined by Jadawi Stefano as they go past the winning post for the last time. Another circuit to go. These two and the leaders throughout. Thomas Rogers and James Shea. We've got four wins apiece on the Hunter Chases so far this season. We need uh, one win more than myself and Paul Rhodes. So we get to the 12th. Oh, and this time it was a mistake by Heathcote Monarch. First mistake he's made. He shuffles back and allows Jadawi Stefano to take a two length advantage as we come inside the final mile. So it's Jadawi Stefano from Heathcote Monarch. Then we're about four back to Swiss Gris, Romantic Liaison on Rainbow Italia under a little bit of pressure. Go to the 13th, they'll take it well. A little bit slow was Romantic Liaison. But up front is Jadawi Stefano, by length and a half to Heathcote Monarch. Then about three back to Swiss Gris. Couple back to Rainbow Italia as they go over the 14th, they'll take it well. Slow again was Romantic Liaison. But Jadawi Stefano holding off all challenges. Challenges as Heathcote Monarch comes to join him again as we come down to five furlongs from home and a further four to jump. Oh, and this time it's Heathcote Monarch makes another mistake and drops further back as Swiss Gris comes alongside to join him. So they're well stretched out now as we come down to the final half mile. They get to the 16th, three from home, and it's Jadawi Stefano leads by about five to Swiss Gris. Heathcote Monarch coming back into it. Rainbow Italia trying to run on and romantic liaison for company. But it's Jadawi Stefano gets to the 17th. There's a cheeky look round, hits the top of the 
fence and it's just oh, it's Stefano still leading but here comes Swiss Chris out of the pack Heathcote might, might well have shot his bolt running on well is Rainbow Italian being pushed along his romantic liaison but Jadawi Stefano's the one they've got to catch we're inside the final quarter mile and it's Jadawi Stefano by about four gets over the ditch well chased on well by Swiss Chris and Rainbow Italia took it well inside a furlong and a half it's Jadawi Stefano Jadawi Stefano from Swiss Chris who doesn't know he's got a lot left Rainbow Italia looks like the only one that may well catch up but here we come down to the last it's Jadawi Stefano they only have half a length to half a furlong to run after this he goes through the top and Rainbow Italia on the outside Jadawi Stefano looks around but Rainbow Italia is going to take this Rainbow Italia Jadawi Stefano Jadawi Stefano Rainbow Italia Jadawi Stefano had a cheeky look round Jockey thought he had it in the bag I think he managed to just nose up so that's a win for James Shea just a little kink there and it is a win for Jadawi Stefano from Rainbow Italia in second Swiss Chris was third, Heathcote Monaco long time leader was fourth and Romantic Layers of Roby one was fifth so James Shea gets his fifth Hunter Chase win of the season moves to the top of the leaderboard, Rainbow Italia for Martin Leading was second Swiss Chris for Stu Gray was third